Hey everybody, thank you for joining me. Smatry Gooseneck. It fits right on the table. I uh, laid it right down like so, got right into the view of uh, my camera. And this is exactly what I've done. I placed it down. And I started to talk and do my work. And it really comes handy uh, what you're looking to do. I uh, really don't have any other uses for this at the given time, but doing this review, fixing my uh, Hobby Zone Sports Cup S, this paid for itself right then and there. My next one, I guess, uh, it's not going to be in a car or uh, doing some uh, extreme stuff with it, but I may uh, put it somewhere else, <laughs> not going to be on my head. Uh, maybe a different angle, or maybe on the uh, chair over here, and have it over my shoulder. There I go. I didn't go on the edge of it. That's why it uh, went around. And I could do my work this way and have a beautiful angle. And what would that look like if I turn my camera on and show you guys? It looks something like this. This is the Hobby Zone Sports Cup. You can see the work I've done on the front of the cow as well as the back of the cow. It's pretty sturdy right now. The glue I used was Gorilla White Glue. It's not made for RC hobbies, but if you use instant glue on this particular plane, this will melt away and destroy your plane in a heartbeat. The white glue will do just fine. Now I hope that given you a uh, great uh, video review of how the smart tree will work and do its job. It's got a strong grip. Uh, if I wanted to use it as a tripod stand, as I've mentioned before, all I gotta do is just bend it in the right angle, and there I have it. I can really get drilled down low with it, like so. And I can stop that shakiness by uh, just working out the angle. There I go, right there. That is pretty neat. I think I said enough. And I hope you enjoyed this at the forums. Check out the Smatry Gooseneck Clamp. Very happy I was able to review it. And once again, I'll see you guys at the forums. Have a great day.